Hi there! I'm Jonathan. Welcome back to Geology with me, Jonathan. Today we're going to be looking at th the rocks and... Uh, uh, oh, I don't know anything about geology and I have to make this documentary by tomorrow. What will I ever do? impressive. I didn't even know there was one. Silence, mortal! You must learn about rocks if you wish to leave this cavern of mine. Cavern of mine? Huh, I see what you did there. But how am I supposed to learn about rocks? I don't know anything about rocks. I don't even know what a rock is. Well, you better get started. Now listen up here, yeah listen good, so your basic geology is understood. I'm the rock god here to teach you the basics of how rocks are in their homeostasis. See, the definition of a rock goes something like this. It's a solid substance with two or more minerals mixed. Rocks are found practically everywhere, and they're especially found in my hair. A mineral is quite different, you know, and I'd better explain that because you're such a nice fellow. A mineral is a natural substance with a fixed crystalline structure. If you don't understand this, my appendix is gonna rupture. Ha! I said my appendix is going to rupture. the hottest rock in the quarry? I came up from the hot spots. Yeah, I'm the hottest rock there is. I was born of the flames. And I'm not somebody that you'd want to diss. You see, I came from the magma, which then became lava as it spooled out of the earth. And the lava cool. And don't be a fool, cause now I got all this new girth. You also should know I'm such a pro. I can vary so much too. Cause there's two different ways that I can be and it can change how my crystals show. You see, intrusive rocks, cool. So very, very slow. So slow that their crystals have plenty of time to grow. Because of this, the crystals are much bigger and much so shiny. But they're not the only ones, so you better watch your hiney. My extrusive brothers are where it's at. They got tiny crystals, but they still watch your backs. And extrusive rocks cool as quick as a flash. The crystals didn't have time to gain much mass. This is because the lava came from the surface after it shot out from the underground furnace. Igneous, igneous, born from the flames today. Oh, igneous, igneous, I'm a bad boy so stay out of my way. I bet you never dreamed that you would meet a guy like me who would rap about all kinds of rocks and teach you lots of things. And if you don't believe me, just check out this cool move. rocks are there. Seriously? I do all that cool dance and that cool song and everything, and all I get is a little, huh, cool? I deserve so much more. <laughs> now who are you? Ha, yeah, I had to put that bozo in his place. He doesn't deserve to be cool, because he doesn't work hard like me. <laughs> you see, kid, I am the sedimentary rock. I originate at the surface of the earth. Hiya! 
What? How did you do that? With my rock power, son. Perfect. I'm back up top now. I can leave. Not before you learn about sedimentary rocks, boy. But I have a dinner reservation at four. Then I will make it speedy. Yeah, this is song number three. And it's all about me. By the end, you'll be singing my name. That's sedimentary. Listen up, boy. Yeah, let me explain. Sedimentary rocks are formed in surface domains. Sand, silt, and dirt, and little rocky boys all gather together. But we don't mind, because the moisture and pressure solidifies us over time. Eventually, there's a whole new substance of its own, which includes shale, coal, and even sandstone. Okay, now can you let me go? Well, hold on just a minute. Now listen here, mister! I want to get home! That's cool! <coughs> I've never murdered anyone before! You should not have done that, Jonathan! Who are you? I am metamorphic rock. I used to advocate this type of behavior. I used to be rash, unthinking, and violent. But I changed my ways. And so can you, Jonathan. I, I promise, I pinky swear I never murder anyone before. Plus, this was a rock. And I'm pretty sure I'm dreaming anyways. This is no dream, Jonathan. How do you know my name then? I know everybody's name. What about my cousin Larry, huh? What's his name? Larry. Wow. That is impressive. No more fooling around. I am here to teach you about rocks, Jonathan. <laughs> No thanks. I think I've had my share of rock knowledge for today. Oh, okay, I guess not. Still don't know what I was waiting for. I had been buried deep down in the earth under a million layers and so much pressure, so much heat, it seemed I couldn't take it anymore. And so, so I turned myself into a, a new guy, from that igneous or sedimentary guy I used to be. And now I am clearly born anew. And by then I had metamorphed, changing under the earth. Pressure or under so much heat. Changes. Because I morphed myself deep, deep underground. Yes, I have changed. I am a new rock now. Mm, yeah. Well, that was certainly an experience. What's next? Nothing. You have learned all you need to know about rocks. Dandy, can I go home now? Oh. Click your heels and you will return. That's it? That's it. Okay. Wow. Today rocked. <laughs> Choo -choo.